Before we start this video, we want you to take a minute and remember when you wanted what you currently have. This is such a deep thought to get through your mind and even through your soul, if that's what you're into, that you need time to process correctly. There were times when you had less than what you have now. There were times when you were less than you are now. Your journey is advancing for the better. Although you might not realize it, the most important thing to pay attention to during this whole ride is the small parts, because the small parts make up the bigger picture. In today's video, we're looking at the six things you shouldn't take for granted. Be grateful you get to experience them and make the most out of them. If you're new here, welcome. Here are the six little things to appreciate in life. We look forward to your comments and likes. Number one, having a great meal. Ever since the early days, people gathered around food. That's why we love it so much. Great food is an experience. It has less to do with nutrition and more to do with the interaction. Food can open minds, hearts and float your brain with just the right chemicals. A good meal will elevate your state of mind. Will make your mind wonder how many more delicious things are out there which you'll never taste. Meals should bring people together. You should enjoy food surrounded by those you care about and be grateful for the opportunity to do so. Number 2. Sharing drinks with your friends and talking. Life is less fun without friends. Your inner circle can pull you out of the darkest places. They can provide hope, comfort, and put your mind at ease. Just chatting with friends about things you find fascinating is sometimes priceless. Add some drinks or an experience to the mix, and you're off to a memorable night. Number 3. Playing with your pet. I mean, pets are just awesome in general. No matter if you have a cat, a bunny, a parrot or you're into reptiles, having a pet will greatly improve your life and make you a better human being all around. Plus, playing with your dog or just watching your dog play can save you thousands of dollars in therapy. Something we found fascinating in retrospect is that although as a human you have a pet for a portion of your life, the pet has you for the entirety of theirs. There's something both poetic and heart-crushing in this. Appreciate your pet and if your day isn't going well, go out for a walk. Number 4. Watching the sun go down. They say the best art is inspired by nature. We believe that some of the best art is nature itself. When's the last time you watched the sun go down? Like really watched and experienced it? The sky slowly changing colors. Blue to peach, to pink to darker blue. There's something just priceless in that the way the light falls on some of the clouds. The tingle you feel in your gut like you've witnessed something extraordinary. We appreciate sunrises as well, but we found sunsets to be more dramatic and emotional. Number 5. Snuggling in bed on a lazy day. Having a lazy day once in a while is actually recommended. We've talked about pushing hard and hustling non-stop until you get it, but you'll find out that you'll force yourself to be on a continuous sprint. Sooner than later, you're going to burn out you'll feel like you're not making enough progress and choose to quit. But remember, when you get tired, learn to rest, not to quit. That's where these lazy days come into play. Now, as long as they're spread out accordingly, the last thing you want is for every day to be a lazy day. We found that after extended periods of focused work, we get optimum results if we disconnect from work for 24 hours and just do what we feel like doing to get our minds to relax and our bodies to be less tense. This ties really well into how disciplined you are if you are serious about changing your life for the better. The most powerful tool anyone can master is discipline. Number 6. The time you have with your parents. One day your parents will die. I know this is a very strong and sad point to put in a positive video with, but the sooner you accept the reality, the sooner you can take action. No, most families are not perfect. We all have our own issues, but problems are meant to be solved. You have a deadline on solving the issues you have with your family, on letting them know that they mean so much to you that despite not giving you everything you wanted, they gave you everything they could give. Drink a beer with your dad, bring your mom flowers. Talk to them about their lives. Help them and tell them that you love them. Do it for both them and yourself. Don't postpone this because if you do, you might come upon a day when it's going to be too late. 
Thank you for spending your time with us and make sure to subscribe to get more videos like this. Don't forget to smash the like button.